Hi, my name is Mike Sebert. I'm an avid lifetime hunter and also a member of the NRA and the National Wild and Turkey Federation. Today, I'd like to talk to you about how to practice hunting with a shotgun for about.com. Before going hunting with any shotgun or any weapon, you'll need to do several things. You'll have to obtain the proper permits and or hunting license in order to successfully and legally hunt whatever you are after. You'll also need to prepare your gun and have all the safety equipment necessary. Safety glasses are a must and also hearing protection. I carry around earplugs that I have with me at all times. Depending on what you are going hunting for, you will need the proper attire. Uh, orange hat is required for certain hunting techniques. You always want to make sure the safety is on when in traveling and before you prepare to shoot. Never point it at anyone, always point it up or down and in a safe position. When shooting, always be aware of your surroundings. Make sure that beyond your shot and your shooting range, there are no people, houses, livestock, anything that can be damaged by your shot exceeding past your target. In preparing for target practice, you always want to have the gun that you will be hunting with to get more comfortable with and used to. You want to have plenty of ammo and plenty of targets. Another important thing to think about is having a place to safely practice. A lot of people like to use a target range. When you go to a target range, they have rules set up for each separate one and guidelines to follow. I like to use a field that is adequate for what I need. Got a target with a nice high backdrop to avoid any overspray or overshot. When you choose to target practice, there's several different ways you can go about it. One is a stationary target like I have behind me. It's really good for getting your balance, getting used to the gun, and just getting a few shots off to be comfortable with it. Another kind that I like to use is clay pigeons. It is a moving target and it's basically there to help you control your hand-eye coordination and your movement just like you would if you were hunting birds. One of my best tips for helping you become a better hunter is I like to call it horizon lining. What I'll do is get my stance and I'll pick a spot on the horizon and I will follow it and look down. This will help you line up your bird and become a better swing until you're ready to shoot. And now, with all your safety precautions in place, you are ready to get ready to fire your gun. Step one, once your safety's on, everything's there, you can now take your shell, load it into the magazine. Step two, you'll want to take it, manually load it into the chamber. Your gun is now ready to fire. Your stance when shooting is very important. You want to take your lead leg, place it out a little bit in front of you, and your back leg, set to take the brunt. You will have some recoil from a shotgun. Secondly, you want to be up over your leg so that way you have a wide base. When you pull the gun up, pull it up strong and let it sit in the crook. Thank you for watching and for more information on how to practice hunting with a shotgun, visit us on the web at about.com.